Hi guys and welcome back to another LucaVision video and I want to welcome each and every one of you straight back to my channel and straight back to another Better Dawn Fest 2022 reaction video. Yes guys, as we all know, I'm doing a little mini series on this channel where I react to each and every song that is participating in Benidorm Fest 2022 and the winner of which will eventually go on to represent Spain at the Eurovision Song Contest 2022. Now guys, if you've missed out on any of the previous videos I've done in this series, please click that link up the top there somewhere and it will take you straight to the playlist. I wouldn't want you missing out on your favourites. However, first of all I did a little recap video and I've seen which of the songs have the best instant impact in my opinion and now I'm looking at each and every one in full. And in today's video, judging by that title straight down there, I'm going to be reacting to Chanel and her track Slow Mo. Now this is one of the songs that stood out to me when I did a little recap video. So I'm really looking forward to hearing this song in all of its glory in its full 2 minutes and 54 seconds. But before I press play, I really want to know what you think about this song. Please let me know your thoughts down below. Where does this sit in your top 14? I cannot wait to read through your comments guys. But I'm excited to do this, so let's go. Enough chat. Let's react. Unfortunately, I cannot help myself but to think of two famous Chanel's. The famous Chanel's from Scream Queens and Chanel the African grey parrot who flew away from her owner. But by the looks of things, we have a third iconic Chanel just about to go. So let's do this. Let's go. Let's go. Ah, instantly, boom. This has a bit of a sultry undertone. Oh, love the build where the music kind of fades away and her vocals come to the forefront. Ah, this is right up my street. It sounds so commercial. Oh, this is definitely something I would download and put on my playlist. This has a great little hook in it. Oh, and I love those bass and the drums. This is definitely something that would take off if it was released in England. Mm. There are so many different elements in this that keep you on the edge of your seat. So many little hooks in there. It's full of energy. It's just jam-packed. Drop. It's so easily attainable as well. You only have to hear it once and it gets stuck in your head. Now I know this isn't a fan favourite, but it is one of my favourites. I think this is so good. It's good enough for Eurovision. I think it's amazing, but I don't think it's Eurovision competitive. I feel like it might get lost on translation on the stage. She definitely has a modern and fresh aesthetic to her, doesn't she? Also, it's like a laid back bop, isn't it? It's not too in your face, but it's not boring. Also, in that middle lane, you can hear that she has a great vocal on her, but it's hidden behind the production. Oh. oh, with an abrupt ending there, guys. That was great. I really liked that song, but it's time to debrief. So guys, what did I think? Overall, I thought that was really, really good and it is still one of my favorites, but I don't think it would be the right choice to send forward for Eurovision. Just because it doesn't have that instant impact factor, it is more of a growability factor. I only had to listen to it once to get that tune stuck in my head. And it is that hook that will draw you in each and every time. And there is a lot going on in the production, there's a lot going on in the music, but I do feel like it could get lost on a big stage and compared to the other songs, I don't think it will stand out. But standalone, I think it is great and it has great radio potential and it is quite commercial. So will I download it? Yes, but would I vote for it to go forward? I don't think so. But guys, that was just my thoughts on the track Slow Mo by Chanel. I really want to know what you think of this down below. Let me know all of your thoughts. If you are enjoying the Benidorm Fest 2022 content on this channel, please be sure to hit that thumbs up button, that subscribe button and that bell notification button. That way you can stay up to date with all of the content I have coming out on this channel. But that is all for me today. All that's left for me to say is thank you so much for watching. Please stay safe, look after yourselves and I'll see you in the next one. Take care everybody. Hasta luego.